So with the latest update, we got a ton of new features, secret features, even some features appearing to be secret because people don't know how to activate them or what they do or what they really entail. And I'm going to be giving you the full rundown on some of these features and diving into some of them in this video here specifically, just so you know what to do and how to uh, work with these features. You know, dude, it's a bright day in Brookhaven, beautiful, everything, look at this glorious bear. This is person's night. Oh, oh my God, dude, uh, what kind of teleportation is that? Anyways, guys, hit the like button, subscribe, comment below if you are enjoying the new update. Just comment below, uh, cats, for Rosie, and, and then people are going to be like, why is the comments section full of the word cats? Because cats are amazing, and, uh, 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 like, dude, cat, cats are dogs. Uh-oh, dude, that's a debate for the century. But, of course, we got Rosie on the shoulder here, the adorable, amazing uh, mascot, <laughs> even honestly, we love Rosie to pieces. But today we're going to be diving into some of these features. You will see a lot of new vehicles have something changed to them now in Brookhaven. It's different, dude. I didn't make the rules. The rules made the rules. So yeah, now some of the vehicles have differences to them, and you will notice it's usually with this little feature here down at the bottom left. There is now the availability for a lot of cool things, for sighting a lot of cool things. If we click this little gear down at the bottom, we're going to see two new features. We have this feature here, which is allows you to run on mobile and then we have this feature here which enables different various and in, in various vehicles the ability to add baby car seats now how does this fully function how does it work we're going to dive into all that too now what i do want to say is a foresight that feature right there probably entails that this is also where free cam is going to go on mobile i think they really i think wolfpack's been planning to, or trying to figure out how free cam could possibly work on mobile because mobile players don't have free cam and that's kind of bad dude no no free cam for mobiles i can't believe it right so i think this is also going to be where free Free cam is added for mobile players, so that's something to kind of just wait for and anticipate in one of the future updates because I definitely most likely believe that's going to be added. I hope so because I believe mobile players would enjoy that feature a lot for the skits and various different role plays. But if we go ahead and look at the vehicles here, we're going to spawn in this. I don't think this thing has. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, this is cheat codes, dude. I didn't know you could put the baby on the back of a scooter, dude. You Okay, so apparently even these, even these, dude. I got my new born baby boy back here. All right, so if we want to change it to a girl, we just go over here and we press this one. And then it should change it. Why is it not changing it? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we need to, like, despawn it and spawn it again. Where is it? There it goes, and it's now a baby girl. That's so amazing. So, yeah, if you look there. That's how you're going to change it uh, to the vehicles. Now, what I must entail and say right away, guys, this changes it for every vehicle, okay? Every vehicle changes it. That's all you got to know. So, any vehicle that I spawn in, it's going to have this implemented into it. Even some of the random vehicles, like the new Street Sweeper. Look at this. Boom. If you guys didn't see the full video, we did debunking this and kind of diving over this. And a lot of times, it adds a baby on board sticker. Amazing, isn't it? I would say so myself. So yeah, we have a baby on board sticker that gets added to all the vehicles as well. Now, what is the rundown on the secrets? You know, what's the secrets, guys? What's the secrets in this update? I mean, I've been talking about that too, so we're going to dive into that in a little bit. But yeah, so it puts a little baby on board sticker. You can then change it here. And now the other feature, like I said, is to do with running on mobile. So yeah, if you play mobile a lot and uh, you will notice that you can't really make your character run at a high speed that you can normally do on PC. This is why I also think a lot of these features introducing themselves to mobile and these availabilities and new functional interface that we're receiving right now is going to aid in future updates such as free cam getting added to mobile and other amazing things getting introduced to mobile and throughout the course of the future updates that's going to be arriving in the next few weeks. However, that be the case, future updates and things arriving in the next few weeks is going to be insanely exciting because now this kind of shows us that we thought this update was going to be a big update. It was three weeks. We thought this update was going to be huge and full of all kinds of secrets even and things that were going to blow us away. Well, it was a new vehicle, a new house, and a couple new features that made people feel slightly underwhelmed. I don't believe it was an underwhelming update by no means. I think it was a rather great update in the house that it got introduced with this update and the new vehicle. Uh, kind of aiding into that and adding some cool new baby roleplay options as well. Being able to put the baby car seats into uh, any vehicle is a great step towards laying some more groundwork. Now, what does this mean for the next update that we're going to see in a couple weeks, few weeks, a month? Dude, no, please. Not a whole month between an update. That would be absolutely detrimental. But... And last year, we did see some times where the update slowed down. We didn't really know what to expect, but then we got a big one out of nowhere. I think this house here is a beautiful, elegant house full of lights, vanities, and everything. Wait, is that a baby stroller? 
Oh, look at this. She's got the baby stroller in there. And she's got a baby in there. So this is perfect, actually. This is a baby stroller. As you, is that a doll or is that an actual baby? I don't know, dude. Is that a player or what? I can't even tell. I can't tell, dude. The accuracy. Okay, why did she just... Okay, she just came out of her house, walked around into the garage. Do they got like a vehicle? I don't know. Maybe they have a vehicle and they're going to go off into a picnic or something. At this time of night, kind of dangerous. Yep, they're in the vehicle. I, I guess they're going to go to the grocery store probably to get some groceries before it closes around 9. Um, the grocery store secret is something very interesting that we encountered, if you guys uh, noticed. Please don't run me over there, ma'am, with your baby. Please don't. I would appreciate it. Thank you. You're very nice. Why is there koalas on the board up there, dude? Oh my god, this is too unexplainable. Unexplainable. So, with that, that's the rundown on how to add baby car seats. You could do this on mobile as well, which is a pretty cool beneficial thing. Um, and the other feature, of course, the mobile running. Also, this is something that I didn't touch on. We also have new animations. As you can see, KO'd. Look at this dude I got knocked out. Boom. So yeah, this is pretty cool. We have a lot of cool new uh, animations that we normally didn't have. We even got a boxing one. Look at that. Bup, bup, bup. Dude, these new animations are actually top of the line. I actually like these. Um, you know, it's cool to see this getting expanded upon and getting all these new animations. Like, I'm all for it. Uh, we got some jumping jacks here, sit-ups even, dude. We can do full-out workouts. I love it, okay? I love it. So, 100%. I'm liking the new animations as well, Wolfpack. Um, amazing as ever. But with that aside, that's probably going to be the full rundown. I'm going to give you guys a quick update as well for me. We're going to have tons of content coming out soon, and live streams are going to finally be starting again. Um, it's been a long period of not, not being able to consistently live stream, but we got the internet. We got everything kind of summed together. I'm currently in the middle of traveling right now. That's why the uh, the audio might be slightly d different. You know, it might sound different because we're using a completely different setup. Everything's a little bit wonky, but it's still here. We're still getting the content delivered to you at full force. But... Will there be an update Friday? Um, that is a good question. I don't believe so unless it's going to be a minor, small update. I think Friday we're going to be getting towards, you know, the waiting period of another bigger update. This update was phenomenal and uh, it's definitely going to be a little while before that next big update that we see and can anticipate. So, yeah, with that being said, though, that's how you activate some of the new features. That's some of the new features in general. The new animations are absolutely phenomenal. I love them. And uh, that's going to be the full rundown for today's video. Once more, thanks for all the support uh, through the ups and downs and all around. You know, we're always facing some type of adversity in life but we have to we have to keep going i guess i don't know I, I was thinking of something inspirational dude i'm not an inspirational person i guess i don't know but either way what matters is you guys are welcomed here we love you here and uh, we're going to continue making amazing content love you guys so much and we'll see you all in the next one